During the course, we have built different models and we have talked about implementing different algorithms in PHP. And we have already seen that with the very few algorithms that we learned, the possibilities are endless. But now let's answer this question. Is PHP really good for machine learning? Well, the short answer is yes and no. Yes, it is very fast. Yes, it is modern. Yes, it is very easy to learn. And yes, it is widely used. More than 70% of all the websites have PHP as their core. But there are a few disadvantages of using PHP in machine learning. For example, there aren't a lot of specialized machine learning libraries. Compared to what we have in Python, there are very few libraries in PHP. And we need better efficiency when dealing with complex data. And by complex data, I mean both in terms of scale, like if we have billions of texts that we have to deal with, and also in terms of data types. When we are dealing with audios, videos, images, we need better algorithms. We need more efficient and optimized algorithms to use those data for our machine learning projects. And we need better community support. Yes, PHP's community is absolutely amazing. They are always updated with the latest technologies. They are always helpful. But when it comes to machine learning, you cannot find a lot of communities to help you with machine learning in PHP. If you ask a question in PHP's community, you will get very few answers. And when you ask that in machine learning communities, the 99% of them tell you, why are you using PHP? I've also asked this question on my Twitter. I asked, do you use PHP for machine learning or you prefer Python? And 72% were surprised and didn't know that we can use PHP for machine learning too. <laughs> so if you ask me what is the potential future developments for machine learning in PHP, I would say, well, the very first thing that we need better libraries, more optimized and efficient libraries that support more algorithms. We need better community support. We need greater use of machine learning in web application. The more we use machine learning in our web projects, the more we realize the flaws of the current algorithms and what are the needs, what are the requirements, what are the steps that we need to take. And the further we develop our libraries, the further we develop our communities and improve our projects as a whole. That's it. I hope you enjoyed the course. PHP is a very powerful language and machine learning opens a lot of opportunities. And when we use machine learning with PHP, the possibilities are endless.